finally, after all these kinds of stupidity that I have to deal with for the past few years, I'm going to try to explain what the hell is going on. So anyways, uh, hello, I'm actually the owner of this channel, and uh, some of you subscribers may know me as that one person who made some crackhead videos of a bunch of 3D Italian weeboos. And I'm just sitting there. And I decided that I think it's for the best if I try to explain what the hell happened a long ass time ago. Uh, the reason why the hell I stopped making MMD videos. But the reason why I'm making this rant now is because I'm probably going to do some borderline MMD videos. Except that it's going to have more stuff on there than just Miku Miku dance videos. I just have one question for you, love. Where do you pull your guns from? <laughs> I keep them up my ass. It takes a lot of practice. Well, anyways, I'm just here to explain to you people what has happened before that I caused me to to just not be in a Italia fandom and in a Miku Miku dance fandom at all. Long story short, basically, it's like the Steven Universe fandom in Hetalia and the and what I meant about that is that uh, they would like well they're always accusing other people of racism when it's not and it's just stupid and I could understand and that's more understandable than just getting offended over some space rock and but seriously I don't know but yeah a lot of people they just get angry for no reason when they re when it's really nothing to be angry about and not be given a big deal and people are too emotional invested in this kind of weird stuff for some weird reason and and the um, what all well, the stupidity I have to deal with and uh, a lot of people they just get offended easily so basically I think they're the first generation of social justice warriors to be honest, I'm not exactly sure, and uh, and I was uh, basically humiliated by some of them before when I was younger, and because and I became so anxious about my drawings that I basically I don't even I even draw with fear when first of all, bitch, I draw because I love to draw, not because I really shouldn't feel this way when I'm make when I'm draw when I'm doing something. That is fun for me, which is fucked up. And when I find out that I that I was in that state, and my mental state isn't going is, is not well because of how the how abusive as shit the fandom is, I decided to fucking leave. Be and I I raged out one day because my head was hurting and everything, and I pissed someone off and all the other stuff because because first of all, if this if I put my fucking deviation on a wrong folder on Divin Art. On the fan club? Why the fuck nobody told me? And if you're... But like, why aren't you responsible for that shit? And nobody asked... Because... I don't know, it's just so complicated. But yeah, these people nowadays, they, they're so fucking arrogant. So full of themselves. They think they know what the fuck is an OC supposed to be. Like, I research a lot. I... My OC is way more accurate. Look, fuck the a inaccuracy, eh? Right? The fucking show isn't even accurate either. Why the fuck is China part of the Allies? I asked my fucking world history teacher about this shit. He's like, well, not really. He's not really a, a freaking ally. He's just a victim or some shit. I don't know. Something like that. And I'm just like, well, what the fuck? But anyways, but yeah, seriously, like, wh what are you talking about? Why are you making it seem like, like, it's not even a good show to learn history. If I, you think about it, because they basically deny what hap the Holocaust ever happened. So, the fact that, the, it's, it's kind of ironic how these people are so defensive about how, about racism and whitewashing when they actually, when the freaking show is borderline denying the Holocaust even happened, which is retarded as hell. I'm allowed to say that because apparently I have autism, but I don't fucking know, okay? I think I'm just weird, and people just think it's, it's something wrong with it, and I'm just like, no. I don't know, that's a whole other fucking story. But anyways, the thing is, and so that happened. So anyways, about the Miku Miku, oh my fucking god. You have no idea how fucked up this whole community is. So, well, Italians have has something to do with this. 
So basically, these Japanese modelers, they became so xenophobic because of these pieces of shit assholes that they decided to not distribute their shit to to foreigners, only to Japanese people, because apparently Japanese people are angels, when in reality they could be assholes if they want to. But anyway, but I have nothing to complain though, because the thing is, this piece of shit deviant on Deviant are decided to be a fucking asshole to Roko, and that is why she decided to not fucking distribute her shit anymore. This piece of shit, Russian Romano zipper piece of shit, weebo looking motherfucker. I don't even know. I cannot tell you who it is. Uh, that's the only hit I can tell you. They ship Russia and Romano for some weird fucking reason, even though there's nothing about their relationship in the show. But anyways, um, I don't know. But this asshole decided to fuck it up for everybody. Because this person redistributed, edited, and all the other fucked up shit. It basically broke a shit ton of rules. And that is why that piece of shit like him done fuck it up for everybody. And that is why I can't get models. And if I ended up getting models, somebody might report my ass. And there was this one person that pisses me off a lot because this person is so, uh... I felt like this person is very, um... How do I say it? Self-centered. Very self-righteous, let's put it that way. It's self-righteous about the Japanese culture and all the bullshit, even though that person is Japanese themselves. Which makes no... I know that makes no sense, like, wait, what? But what I meant is that this person be talking about how people are horrible translator. This person is just too damn strict. And, uh, and then this person... Basically, it's a fucking snitch. And I felt like if this person discovers my videos and they see that I'm using modelers and I, I'm clearly not Japanese... Even though those modelers are, models are meant for Japanese people, that person probably gonna snitch me out or something. So I can't use the Italia models anymore because of assholes like these and because of that stupid ass shit these dumbass people on DeviantArt has done. And now I'm pissed. And that's why I can't do Miku Miku dance videos anymore. It's not really because of my anxiety. That's not really it. It's the legal issues. It's the fucking... Uh, credit and the legal issues even though i give credit to these modelers that's not really enough i had to follow their rules i had to follow their even if it's bullshit so and i don't want to get into trouble all right because these fucking people on the community they're wild they're insane because i heard so many stories of people stalking the not let it go of some stupid ass little thing that doesn't even hurt anybody but for some weird reason this person got so offended they had to stalk this one person that made the mistake when they were like 12 years old and they're already like 21 right now over the same shit it's just ridiculous this whole dumbass call out culture and all that other stupidity just fucking ridiculous and what, what the fuck is this hillary clinton but anyways um freaking elections all that so anyways, this that's basically it, okay? And the reason why I didn't even talk about this is because I was afraid of people just coming after my ass for the same reason. Look, motherfucker, you have to face the fact. You're a piece of shit. Why would you go after somebody over some dumbass mistake that probably didn't even know about because they're like 12 years old and then come after them when they're like adults and actually stop doing that shit because they started to notice... Because it's not, they already noticed that it's not, it's, act, it's really cringy. Recoloring the fuck out of models. And they already knew about it. Or they got over with it. I don't even know. But the fact that you went, you're gonna stalk somebody over some stupid ass shit of what happened years ago. And that's, and that applies to these dumbass Tumblrets too. Because oh my fucking, uh, the fucking, fa I never knew people can be this fucked up. I never fucking knew. And they're young ass people too. No, what's fucked up is that there's adults dumb as shit like that, too. And I'm just sitting there like, look, come on. Okay, why do you have to be offended for everything? You're not going to live peacefully with that kind of mindset. I don't even know. And because of, they're dumbass, we can't even progress because people be thinking, oh, SJW, feminazis, whatever. Motherfucker, things made sense until these idiots just show up, I right? Don't fucking blame everyone for that. Fucking hell. And the Black Lives Matter is already fucking up the same way, too. And I'm fucking pissed. And, and uh, for fuck's sakes, man, why would you beat up a random-ass soldier over after asking a dumbass question? I felt like that girl was planning to beat my ass up in the cafeteria because the same shit happened to me. Somebody asked me, do you like black people? Now I'm just saying that, like, 
Uh, it depends who, if they're an asshole or not. But why the fuck would you ask me that goddamn question? What the fuck? That's like me walking up to somebody and being like, "Hey, do you hate white people?" or some dumbass question like that. But anyways, the, basically that's all that happened. And I'm sorry, I keep ra- I I I stutter a shit ton. I'm sorry, <sighs> but <sighs> it's just terrible. And it was horrible because I have depression and anxiety, probably from all that bullshit. I know it's it's really nothing to give importance to. Hell no, it's nothing important. But oh my god, I didn't even know people can be this savage. I didn't even know. And I didn't even know I was b- brutally bullied. I didn't even know. Until, like, recently. I find out, wait a minute, I have a fucked up life in middle school. I have good friends, though, but I don't know. That was terrible. It was stupid. The whole fuck, my whole fucking teenagehood. And it cringes me just seeing, it makes me cringe, just seeing my old videos. But I let it stay there because I don't want that same bullshit happening to me. Like, what the fuck happened with Ghost P? Rest in peace, Ghost P. Because, oh my fucking god. They came back, but, oh my god. It's just, it's terrible. And... For fuck's sake, man, y'all need to chill. You need Jesus or just meditate or something if you're an atheist. But uh, I don't know. I just, I don't know, okay? Just, what the hell? It's just nothing to be upset about. It's nothing to be angry about. But yeah, I decided to just not work with Miku Miku Dance anymore because of this whole legality bullshit that I have to deal with that it wasn't even fucking there in the beginning. And be- until some asshole decided to fuck it up. So I'm just like, oh, for fuck's sakes. So, uh, I don't even fucking know. I was pissed off because who the fuck made this bullshit rules in the first place? But it's their stuff, so I can't do anything about it. I mean, I, uh, I, mean, I don't care what happens to my models, but they're shitty, so I don't know. But I don't know. I just don't get angry easily. I don't. Unless it's it's stupid, it's really stupid things like this that is so obvious and so easy to avoid. Like, for fuck's sake, what is so hard not getting offended? What is so hard about it? Does everyone hate you that much? I don't understand. I have autism and a pedophile for a grandfather. And I don't get offended by weird shit like that. I actually like dark jokes. So, what the hell? I don't even know, but oh god, I don't even know. Okay, it's the whole thing is a train wreck. Fucking Tumblr, first generation Tumblr, it's all over again. It's just, it's ridiculous. <sighs> so that's what the fuck was happening in the fandom, and that's what the fuck was happening in the community, and why the fuck I left. Cause I nobody got time to deal with these toxic ass people. I don't have time for that, right? Nobody got time for that. I don't have time. So go ahead and unsubscribe from me because I I had to deal with this whole legality bullshit even though I have nothing to do with it, really. But I might get my ass beaten on the internet for that, for doing some, the most littlest shit. So ain't nobody got time for that. Fuck that. I fucking hate arrogant people. So much. So, oh god, just fucking chill, man. I'm done with this shit, man. Please. Have a good school year, please. Have some, just make, do some good grades. Study. Get educated for real. For fuck's sake. Stop with your privileged bullshit, man. What the fudge? Bye, Felicia. Bye. You're fancy.